Come with me for a day in the life. First, we always start out with taking our medications. Fun, fun. We then go on to let the dogs out for a bathroom break after a long night's sleep in our crates. I then usually let them have a little playtime in the morning to get their energy out. Then we head on inside and get ready for breakfast so they each get a cup and a half every morning and night. Then here's me giving it to them so they have to wait for me to say okay for them to have their food so here they are doing that. Then they eat every last bit of it and they stay in their crates because they are prone to bloat so they will stay in their crates a little bit after this. Okay, now it is my turn to get ready for the day. So I am brushing my hair. I'm gonna wash my face, brush my teeth, um, and then I'm going to get dressed and put some makeup on. So here we go. Okay, now that I'm dressed, I'm just putting on some makeup real quick. Nothing special, it's my day off. And I changed about four times today, but that is okay. about to put in my sheets and my bedding into the wash before I leave for my trip so then everything is clean and when I come back I don't have to worry about doing that. So here I am just putting my comforters in first because they take the longest to wash and dry, um, putting in some detergent and I'm about to start it up and then when I come back from running my errands after eating breakfast I all I have to do is just put them in the dryer and um, start my next load. So here I am just starting it up and then I'm about to go upstairs, turn the lights off, leave the dogs down here to chill in the dark with the fan going and make myself some breakfast before I head off because I always find that if I don't do that I tempt myself and buy fast food. So then here I am making my breakfast which is oatmeal. I love the peaches and cream. It's my, been my favorite for a while now. So here I am just putting in the bowl. Um, I didn't show you, but I did add a little bit of oat milk. And then just poured my hot water like usual over top, mixed it up. And then I'm just about to sit down at the table while I'm eating my breakfast and make a list of what I need to pack, what I still need to go out and get while I run my errands. And yeah, but there it is. And then I wrote down my list. And as I was in the middle of doing that and having the last few bites of my breakfast, my mom called me. You'll see my mom come up in a second. And there she is. So we just talked about plans for the weekend and how we're going, whatever. And here I am grabbing my purse, my keys, and I'm about to go run some errands while the dogs have a nap, which they typically do until I get home. And then we have some playtime. So now I am just locking up the house as I leave. About to go walk to my car and head out on the road to grab some things. So I'm taking you along with me to go to the dollar store and get a Starbucks, of course. So here I am doing that. And here I am just about to pull up to Starbucks. There I am wasn't too bad of a line, which was nice, so I got in and out of there quick. Then I'm at the dollar store. Obviously, I had to check out the dog section like I always do. And I got the few things that I needed from there, like toothbrushes, because I prefer to have new toothbrushes just for vacation purposes. And then I drove over to the bank to grab some money for the dog walker, who's walking the dogs while I'm gone. And there I am. And then I came home. Side, put my keys my purse away where it belongs and headed on downstairs but 
I don't let the girls out right away because they need to realize that they need to be calm until I let them out, which they're pretty good at for the most part, but you might hear a little bit of their crying in the background of this video. And then I realized I should probably get their food all scooped together and put it into plastic baggies so I know that they are getting fed exactly what they're supposed to because my dad is watching them while I'm gone. Um, the pet sitter, well the dog walker, is just coming in and walking them once a day, every day. So I scooped out her food with all their supplements and stuff ready for her in the morning after she walks them. And then I'm just scooping out all of the food into separate baggies for each dog for my dad. So it's simple, easy, and we don't have to worry. So here I am scooping out the food, 28 bags exactly, just for the nighttime routine. 28 bags for the morning routine which I already did before this video so that is not included but here we are once I finally finished all of that the girls finally got to go outside and have some playtime and some water and then I came in and I started cleaning as you can tell my room is a disaster so I wanted to get that all cleaned up and ready for when I leave tomorrow night I started to get hot quite quickly, put my hair up, and then I moved over the laundry because I totally forgot. So I moved over the big comforters into the dryer there. And I didn't show it on here because that's boring, but I did end up putting another load in. And then I looked to my right and realized how much laundry I have to finish and fold before we leave tomorrow, as well as I haven't packed my suitcase. And then we took a little dance break with Maisie Moo. Continued on, I vacuumed the carpet, as you can see here, Maisie loves chasing it, and then she backs up, which is nice, and after I was done that, I decided I wanted to enjoy some of the nice weather before it started to rain, so I took the girls back outside and pooper scooped, so that's done before I leave, and the grass also needed to be cut, as you can tell, so I poop pooper scooped, and then I mowed the lawn. And then as I brought the girls inside, I went to grab them a treat out of the freezer because I make them frozen treats. And I noticed the kitchen needed a little bit of help. So I cleaned up the mess a little bit, put the dishwasher as you can see here, and then made the kitchen nice and clean before I leave. So hopefully it is clean when I get home, but who knows with my dad. Here it is all done. It's still a little bit of a mess, but way better than it was downstairs and decided to tackle the laundry which was quite the task in itself but here's me just sorting everything and then starting to get everything folded and put in the right spot while I'm still doing some loads so everything is done and I have clean clothes to pack with. And here I started packing up Caleb's bags and my bag. Caleb's is practically done, mine is not. And here's the girls wanting to squeeze themselves in the suitcase. But I took them outside, got their mind off it because they're pretty upset about me leaving. And we had a little playtime outside. Oh, they went to the bathroom. And then I'm off to Caleb's. Caleb is my boyfriend, by the way, his parents. And we're just going to see them before we leave for two weeks. So I will take you for a little drive with us on that. And then I'm going to upload this video. They love when he gives them treats because he always gives them a lot. Here's a little gift and the card for my dog walker and just some information for her while we're gone. Turn the lights off, go upstairs. We went to McDonald's and got a drink. I love their smoothies, they're so good. And then I came home, fed the dogs dinner. Stay tuned for more videos coming and there will be some nice videos coming up 
for the next couple of weeks while I'm in Newfoundland. So stay tuned for that. Thank you so much. And if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to like and subscribe for more videos to come.